before speaking, I prepared special papers for terminology. So, 315, what do you, what do you really want? So, this is not EC dollars, unfortunately. This is a thermal units, it's a number of amount of energy that we need by the uh, 2050. So, it's a huge amount of energy, that, therefore, we need to search uh, the type of energy which is low cost, which is uh, uh, which is has with high energy capacity. So why nuclear energy? When uh, you, if you ask from energy experts or scientists, majority of them will, would answer that it's a matter of requirement. But when you ask from people and society, they are afraid about it. So let's discuss it. Uh, so, as you know, Kazakhstan is the world largest producer in the world. Uranium. So, uranium has different minerals, but few of them can be exportable. Uh, after processing steps, it will be product like this. So, it's called yellow cake because of color, and the yellow cake has two isotopes. So, first one is uh, 200 uranium 200. Uh, uh, uranium 235 and uh, uranium 238. They are like camaraderie, and uh, we need to separate each other. And uh, so this one is not for us. So uranium 235 uh, and the content of uranium is just 0 0.7, and uh, we need to enrich it until 5 percent. Until 5 percent. So after this step, we do a product like this. So powder product, but this powder product should uh, it's present to form to, to pellet form. So this pellet form uh, will be inserted special rods. Imagine that this is uh, metal rod uh, because imagination leads to you from point A to the point B. So one point uh, what well, one metal rod, two metal rod. Third metal rod. So four, five, water lens pencils. <laughs> so, so yeah, it will move us until over 100 metal rods, and uh, here we go. So once they are ready, uh, they are sent to the nuclear reactor. Inside, chain reaction happens, uh, and the chain reaction is like. Uh, Barium and the Krypton, as I told you, will be splitting into more than Krypton from the Superman. So, when it comes to advantage, so uh, nuclear power plants doesn't burn any fossil fuels, that's why it doesn't emit carbon emissions, which is beneficial to the hills. You know that uh, other uh, thermal plants uh, that burn fossil fuels, uh, it kills people silently, and uh, we don't observe it, observe it because millions of people uh, uh, suffered from lung diseases, for example, lung cancers. Uh, secondly, this granite pellets uh, has capacity, uh, for example, it has it equal to uh, it gives energy of one ton of coal, at least. Uh, so, so, so. Uh, certainly, there are a lot of uh, room for improvement, uh, and it can be replaced by thorium. Thorium is uh, less reductive compared to the uranium, and it has, and also it has uh, huge uh, uh, energy capacity, and uh, it gives. Uh, roughly speaking, uh, two or three million of ton, uh, ton of coal. <coughs> Certainly, uh, uh, when when we speaking when when, when we speak uh, this, this advantage of uh, uh, nuclear power plants, nuclear energy. So the first thing is comes to mind is uh, uh, incidents, uh, Chernobyl and the Fukushima that happened uh, to the humanity. So, of course, uh, small errors can lead to 
terrible consequences and uh, and that's terrible side of uh, nuclear energy. And the second part of uh, disadvantage is that uh, the first application was highly enriched uranium was not feasible reasons. It was atomic bomb, you know. Uh, so at the end, I would state that uh, there are, of course, uh, different opinions. Uh, it, it's really a controversial topic to the talking, but we need to keep in we need to keep in mind that in the future we will definitely have a scarcity of energy, and uh, we need to search uh, uh, search and uh, search new type of energy, and uh, we need to open uh, new innovation and. Uh, so on. Uh, overall conclusion, uh, I would uh, uh, give credit to the, these uh, references, and uh, I cited uh, and used these uh, materials, and uh, my thoughts of these experts and the scientists. Thank you very much.